let's have a look at this. I'm going to start taking them covers off. So I'm going to unbolt them and then we'll have a look inside. See what they're like. Wish me luck. I've undone the bolt and I've gave it a little tap and it's now come loose. So let's have a look. spray some oil in. Don't look too bad. A bit grimy. Interesting. I'll be back with you shortly. I'm just going to spray some oil in. I'm going to take the other side off now. The engine rotates and then stops. I have the feeling it's on this side of the engine that the problem is. So I'm going to start undoing all of that. And then I'll bring you back when I take the cover off. I've just got to take a few of these bits off. So I'm going to give it, I've already sprayed some WD in that side, but I'm going to give it a good soak. So next job is to take this side off. Might have to remove some of these brackets, but we'll see. I'll bring you back when I've uh, took it off. Now we're on to the other side. I've loosened it. Now let's have a look. Ooh. About the same as the other side, really, isn't it? Hello. Finally. After spraying WD, spraying some oil down the cylinders with a uh, syringe, and spraying cleaner all over it, and tapping the rockers slightly when they decompressed, I finally got it free. And it's now doing a full rotation. Phew. That was a pain that was. In mean, there's now all cleaned. It's doing a full rotation now. I would show you but I have to use both hands. See if I can get my uh hang on, I'll be back in a sec. with one hand but yeah it fully rotates now so that means we're all good for the startup video I'm gonna place I'm gonna put a bit more oil in these I even took all the spark plugs out spark plugs and not the best looking but they'll clean up the white brush and then I'll buy some new ones I don't see the point in buying new ones yet. So let's get in there. So that's good now that it rotates all the way around. It means the engine's free. I'll let that sit with the oil on the board in the on the pistons and stuff for a while. And then I'll start looking into getting some fuel lines for when I start it up. Obviously it can't stay running too long, there's no radiator. 
so now that's in the water and free turns freely I'm going to start cleaning some more of this engine bay up yeah but this is what everyone's been waiting for to see what it looked like in there it looks really good to be honest still got to brush some uh, cleaning stuff in there and whatnot I poured a load of oil in there and I'll just let that sit. I'll place the rocker covers back on temporarily. Yeah, I'll be back with you soon.